Quand nous étions petits, nous avons fait des songes adorables mensonges depuis longtemps parti. Bonjour, bonjour. I'm Jan Zeschke with the province dining à la carte on the streets of Vancouver. Today we've wandered down to Gastown for a taste of Brittany, courtesy of Shushu, which uh, makes a variety of crepes in this charmant little trailer behind me. So let's go see what's cooking. So I'm here with Nathalie Gallon of um, Shushu Crepes. Yeah. So tell me first of all, what does Shushu mean? Shushu is mean my sweetie, my love, and. Uh, all the person that you love, uh, really, and uh, so it's dedicated to my son. Awesome. My son, when he's born, I just call him Chouchou right away, and uh, <laughs> I was looking for a name for my crapperie, and uh, there was some French name, very famous, and but no one understand. So after I say, someone say, Nathalie Crepe, I say, forget about that, Nathalie, no way. So after Chouchou, and so it's dedicated to my son, who's now eight years old. So tell me, um, tell me about the crepes that you make. I mean, what kind of crepes do you do here? So here we do the savory and sweet. We just do traditional South of Brittany crepes. Why? Because uh, there is North and South. The North, they flip the crepe one more time. And okay. here we fill the, the, um, the ingredient on the crepe right away. So it's very thin and crispy on the side. Yeah, so... And all, and all, the, all the ingredients you use are sort of Breton... Very Brittany, recipes. very, very French. Like I do the homemade tapenade, there's a mix of anchovy, garlic, or mm. olive and capers. I do the salty caramel, I do the almond, I do the apple compote. Mm -hmm. All the butter is made by hand because if you use the, the mix, the, uh, is uh, going to, no, it's not good. So I don't know, it's sure. just like traditional always. So. And um, the goat cheese, the, I don't know. Yeah. Great. Uh, only the thing that I like. That's it. <laughs> so sounds fantastic. And, um, so, so what do you think you're going to make for me today? I don't know. Would you like happy ever after? So it, because uh, you know all the crepes are named by someone else. So we start with Shushu because it's the name of my son, Alex. Uh -huh. Fred is my best friend. Mary is my grandmother. All the, the menu is dedicated to people <laughs> uh, who's dear for me or, or very nice to me. Happy ever after. That sounds great. All right, let's go check it out. <laughs> That on the salad. It's also something that okay. I like a lot. Okay. Um, Thank you very but, much. But uh, pork, you will never see. All right, so here we have the happy ever after crepe. And look how thin that is. That is razor thin. And it looks absolutely delicious. We got pear, grape, we got goat cheese mascarpone, a bit of honey and walnuts in there. Let's take a bite. Oh, and immediately that fruitiness from, comes out from the pear and the grape. And it's full of that lovely richness of the cheese, which is just melting beautifully in that crepe. Oh my goodness. Crepe's nice and crunchy. It's got a real good flavor to it as well. Oh, that was an amazing crepe. Mm. C'est fini, that's it for me at Shushu Crepes. Uh, thanks to Natalie for showing us around and uh, telling us lots of things we didn't know about Breton cuisine. Uh, for more fabulous videos of Vancouver's street food scene, check out theprovince.com slash a la carte. For the province, I'm Jan Zeschke. Quand nous étions petits, nous avons fait des songes adorables.